The Chinese version of Wikipedia has been banned in China since 2015. Now the authorities there are blocking all language versions of the site. The new measures have been in place since April, according to the Wikimedia Foundation. Kerry Allen is our China media analyst. Wikipedia has been one of the few US platforms that's actually been accessible in China for some time. It's been acknowledged that there has been censorship of certain pages, so articles about, for example, the 1989 Tiananmen Square incident, um, the 2014 Hong Kong protests. But now Wikipedia's foundation have confirmed that the website is outright inaccessible in China, which means that it's reached the level of censorship that platforms like Facebook and YouTube have. It's it's deemed a sensitive platform. And some people have been saying that they think this is a real shame. They use it to learn English, to read about foreign media, read about foreign books, for example. But in China anyway, it's commonly expected that there is a a Chinese version of websites that we access in the West. So for example, whereas we have Google, people have Baidu as a search engine, whereas people have Facebook in the West, uh, people in China have Weibo. And as a result, there's been a competitor with Wikipedia anyway. Uh, Baidu is one of China's biggest media giants and they run the service Baidu Bai Ke. But I mean, this comes at a very sensitive time. Tensions between China and the US are escalating. And it is very interesting that there is this huge media campaign at the moment in China to promote Chinese strength and and say that China no longer needs the US. And this is one of the few US websites that has had a presence in China. And now people in China can't access it. Our China media analyst, Carrie Allen.